Hi, yes, hello, welcome. If you're new here, hi, my name is Ashley, and if you're a returner, welcome back. It's a weird intro, and why is that? Because it's my favorite time of the year. Happy Hello Beans. If you are new here and don't know what this is, this is my October special where I watch scary movies in night vision all alone by myself, and then maybe I find some lighthearted movies that's also Halloween related, but not really scary. The link to Hello Beans 2020, the first ever Hello Beans, is down in the description box below. I got my black nails ready to go. What does it have to do with movies? Absolutely nothing. I just like it. I have redecorated the studio. I don't know if you can tell. If you want a detailed tour of the studio and my redecorating to see everything, that's also linked down in the description box below on my second channel. But I have all my creepy Funkos, scary Funkos, back behind me too, Hocus Pocus, Alien Bates Motel. And then my shelf, I have basically a shrine to Michael Myers, The Exorcist, and Nightmare on Elm Street, along with all of our creepy little guy friends down here. Ah! I love Hello Beans. It's so much fun. I say all the time that I'm a chicken shit, and that's accurate. I don't know why I love scary movies so much, but I really do. So if you are new here, welcome. Like, subscribe, stick around so you never miss an upload during Hello Beans. And I am happy to announce that I am going to do another Hello Beans giveaway this year. Just like last year, there's going to be a hidden message in this review. It'll pop up somewhere on the screen. Be sure you watch the entire video so you can find the hidden message. All you have to do is go down below and type it in the comment exactly what I type on the screen. You gotta have that exact phrase that's on the screen, type it down below. You can add to it if you want, add another comment. If you have a fun fact about the movie, that's A-OK. -okay. But you have to have the secret phrase in the comment down below. More information on the giveaway to come in future videos, so be sure that you watch. Today is actually a Millennial Movie member request, and it is the 1996 Scream. I have vivid memories of like when I was in high school, I feel like the parodies of Scream, what what was it, Scary Movie, came out. I never went and saw those either because I didn't understand the context, but I've never seen this one. I'm very excited. I feel like this is one, well one, it has a shit ton of parody movies. There's a spider, okay. I just killed one of you fuckers yesterday. The costume is always at Walmart. Like, it's always a costume. You see hundreds of them on Halloween night. And I feel like this is another one of those scary movies that usually gets brought up in sitcoms. Family Guy. You know, I feel like there's always that white mask with the long mouth and the black eyes and it's just a, a cape and a knife. That's the costume at Walmart, at least. I don't know if there's going to be an origin story like, you know, Michael Myers or Freddy Krueger. I don't know if Scream has an origin, but I'm very excited to find out what he does that's so scary and is it actually scary. All the scary ones are done in night vision. So no more diddle dallying, let's get right on into today's Millennial Movie member request, which is the 1996 Scream in night vision. nervous. If you don't know this about me, you best know this about me. I'm scared of the dark. Like for real in general. I don't I sleep I sleep with the bathroom light on. I uh, I sleep with a stuffed animal. Like I don't like the dark. Oh, I'm nervous. Here we go. Ah. <laughs> Hi friends. Oh, the heartbeat and the scream. Great. Off to a great start, friends. Hello. Yes. Is that Drew Barrymore? Wait, wait, don't hang up. What? I want to talk to you for a second. They've Why? got 900 I'm already nervous! Why am I such a little chicken shit? Uh, I caught one of those on fire one time. What's your favorite scary movie? Uh, I don't know. Yeah. The Exorcist so far. Mm, Halloween. No, oh, the Halloween's one with the guy good too. White mask. I wore the shirt today! I didn't even know that would be mentioned. Fingers. Yeah, Freddy Krueger. Freddy, that's right. I like that movie. This guy's voice is very soothing. You never told me your name. Why do you want to know my name? I want to know Why is he asking so many questions? This has me stressed. 
I want to know who I'm talking to. That's not what you said. I was talking and I missed what he said, but I think he said something bad. A game. No? So he sees her! He sees her! I already have goosebumps. Please. They'd never make it in time. We're you get your popcorn off the stove. To see what your insides look like. No! Not good. I'm calling the police. <laughs> How do you know his name? Turn on the patio lights. So you do have a boyfriend and you lied. Are you a little ho? Oh my god, did he kill Steve? Oh, Steve! Oh god, you've been through it. I want to play a game. Play the game! Play the game! Don't play the game! Don't play the game! Michael Myers! Name the killer in Friday the 13th. Jason! No, Mrs. Voorhees! Then you should know Jason's mother, Mrs. Voorhees, was the original Suck killer. Suck it! Jason. Suck it! Steve would still be alive today if I were his girlfriend! What happened? I hear it, but I don't see it. Oh my god! What did he use to cut that deep, that far, that fast? Door am I at? Oh, I don't like that question! Well, he's not at the patio doors, so it's at the front. Ah! Shit, I was wrong! Oh, there's smoke in the kitchen! I told you to get your damn popcorn! So is he just running around in the house right now? He's just running around in the house. That's a good strategy, girlfriend. Run away from the house now. You're out. He's busy looking for you. Like, you see a car coming. I don't understand why you're not running towards it. Who is that? If Steve's dead... Oh, me! Just a stab to the heart. She's putting up a great fight. I simply would have died by now. Who is this? Oh, is this her parents? We don't get to find out who it is? He has the other phone and they're listening to it. She does. That's clever. <laughs> what? Let me see. <laughs> me, don't do that. She's really pretty. <laughs> what was I gonna do? Karate chop it? You sleep in there? Yes, I sleep in there. <laughs> it ain't the cutest thing ever. No, I was home watching television. The, uh... The exorcist was on. Oh no. <laughs> it got me thinking of us. I'm sorry, what? Lately we're just sort of edited for television. Oh my god. No, I wouldn't dream of breaking your underwear rule. Underwear rule? Can I learn more about the underwear rule? She lucky her face is so good looking because that nightgown ain't doing nothing for her. Blood, huh? All right. That reporter is wearing a lime green outfit. That would never fly on camera. And we're not just talking killed, we're talking why don't we be killed. We're talking big dead. Becca, she's just texting me in English. Not anymore. Not anymore. <laughs> worse than what? There's a backstory worse than what? Uh, Sydney Prescott. Prescott. That guy. That guy. That guy looks very familiar. So encouraged to return to their homes probably from school. That doesn't make any sense. The students were killed at their house. So returning home quickly doesn't necessarily mean they're safe. How do you get someone? Well, well, you stop. I'm just kidding. He still was with me last night. So that guy. Yeah, Does he end up playing Scooby Doo in the live action movie that came out in the 2000s? I mean, does he end up playing Shaggy? Not Scooby Doo. Shaggy in Scooby Doo. Because I heard that they found her liver in the mailbox next to her spleen and her pancreas. It's now really the time to make jokes. Oh, yeah, I forgot she'd be home alone. Why don't you ask your boyfriend over? What? What? Scary music, what? See, I told you that lime green outfit does not good, look good on camera. Was that her mom? Is that what I'm supposed to gather? Yes, that was her mother. Oh girl, you were supposed to go to Tatum's and I think it's too late! Thinking Tom Cruise and all the right moves. You know, if you pause it just right, you can see his penis. When is that movie gonna make it on the channel? Tatum, just get in the car. Hello, Sydney. Oh no. Where am I? 
Oh, uh, he's already in the house. You're really just going to walk out after a stranger tells you they're on your front porch? I would never. Oh my God, she's way braver than I am. What am I doing? Huh? <laughs> That's some shit I would do. If you hang up on me, you'll die just like your mother. You had to bring her mama into this? stayed somewhere else I don't know is it her dad what are you doing with a cellular telephone everybody's got one sheriff I was gonna say that question's a little outdated Sydney said you crawled through a window last night too you went out last night he tried to get him some punani hell he's a teenager why are you looking at her it, like Get over yourself! You can't blame her for this! We sell this costume every five and dime in the state. Oh, so it's just a generic costume. I'm sorry, Deputy Dewey boy, but we're ready to go now, okay? <laughs> that is a hard dynamic. I'll send you a copy. Oh! Oh, oh damn! Bam! Sid! Super bitch! <laughs> Super bitch! <laughs> Do you really think Billy did it? I mean, all signs point to yes? But, like, it can't be that easy. Hello. Why does he kind of look like a knockoff Italian Ryan Reynolds? Does that make sense? It was handed down after the young Sydney testified day. against him. A she death was sentence? The... Oh, wait, wait, wait. That's not Billy. That's not Billy. Sorry, I thought that was her boyfriend. So how does it feel to be almost brutally butchered? Hey. What kind of question was that? The same someone who planted it in Cotton's car framing him. Really, because that means somebody had to go through a lot of trouble to frame this one guy. I don't think that's accurate. <gasps> wait, 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 wait. Was she having sex with Cotton? The father was m jealous and mad. Like, I mean, obviously she was having an affair. He killed her, blamed it on Cotton to get him put away. And now, because we can't find him, he is the killer now. <laughs> Okay, that's not okay to do. Couldn't have been me. I was in jail. Remember? Oh, so he's really upset about that. Okay, that's good to know. And I have a girlfriend who would rather accuse me of being a psychopathic killer than touch me. Oh, wow. You're a douchebag. You haven't been the same since... since your mother died. Can you think about what you just said for a minute? That changes a person. So... Two of your fellow students. Some, some big old scissors. Fairness would be to rip your insides out, hang you from a tree so we can expose you for the. Sir, are you the murderer? Cause that's a little heavy. You're about to get punched in the face, bitch. Girl, how the hell are you popular with your purple sweater tucked into your khaki pants? Oh, there's a whisper. I would never be by myself. I said it before it happened. I would never be by myself. Oh, I don't like a this. Oh my god! <gasps> ah! Okay. In the school building? In the school? Is it the principal? All classes are suspended until further notice. Nice! Well, he's not a suspect, is he? We haven't ruled him out as a possibility. Stop talking to her! <laughs> Please, call me Gail. She a snake! I don't like her! Sir. Sir, no. We're not doing that today. Okay, so he's about to get got, so that means he's not the killer. Damn little shits. Would you call me? <laughs> 
Jenny! Oh, your closet's closed. What's up with him getting in closets? Oh, f Why did I not think about being behind the door? So she's found out that her mom slept around. This girl's going through it. Oh! Is this a blockbuster? If you were the only suspect in a senseless bloodbath, would you be standing in the horror section? And why would you be flirting with other girls? Isn't your heart supposed to be broken? Do you think Sid would go out with me? <laughs> oh my god! What a scumbag! Sydney needs better friends. Are you telling me that's not a killer? I mean, that's a good point. Billy is kind of creepy. Okay, so now that the principal is dead, I really do think it's the dad. That's my final answer. Billy and his penis don't deserve this, right? These in this grocery store? Ain't nobody see this man walking around with a mask on? Ain't nobody see him doing that? Guess what tomorrow is? The anniversary of his wife's death. So it is the dad. Now hold on a second. The killer in the bathroom had those kind of shoes on. Hold on a second. Is it Dewey? I gotta stop guessing. I gotta stop guessing or I'm gonna drive myself crazy. Not much of a story here. Just a bunch of kids cutting it loose. Cutting it loose what you really wanted to say? <gasps> a recorder. How come oh, Jamie Lee Curtis is in all of these movies? Because Jamie Lee Curtis is amazing. Oh, I don't like her. Also, nobody acts like that to news reporters. <gasps> She's making a camera. I thought it was just an audio recorder to keep in her pocket. Okay, she's about to die. Would you like to know how I know that? Her nipples are hard. And this is a scary movie. It's just fact. It's just fact. Y'all hear that phone ring? Did y'all hear it? Because I called it. Lose the outfit. If Sydney sees it, she'll flip. It ain't a movie. It's real life, bitch. It ain't Randy, girl. Why did she not scream? She just got her forearm cut. You take one of the broken bottles and you stab him with it. <gasps> oh no. Well great, now I have a fear of garage doors. Okay, I don't think it's the dad anymore. No, I do think it's the dad. I don't think it's Dewey. Because why would he kill his sister? Jody Foster in Silence of the Lambs when... I still haven't seen that one yet. They go have sex! Ah, uh, sex in scary movies never works out, just like nipples being hard, they're about to die. One of them is, at least. Breasts. I want to see Jamie Lee's breasts. When do yeah. we see Jamie? Don't we all? Don't we all? Jamie Lee was always the virgin in horror movies. She never showed her tits. Well, now I have to watch Trading Places to see Jamie Lee Curtis's titties. Pop with sex her. equals yes. death, okay? No it's true, kids! Keep that in mind! Get another beer, you want one? Yeah, sure. I'll be right back! <laughs> Care to join me? I'd love to. Oh my god! Dewey is letting his pee pee lead the way! You gotta think with this brain! Not that head, you know what I mean? Do you know what that consolation is? No, what is it? I don't know, that's why I was asking. <laughs> that's so funny. How's that sex going? Y'all ain't naked. Here comes the obligatory tit shot. Hey, I have that signed poster right there! Or sign a uh, headshot right there. Shout out to Bleeding Green! Oh, we about to get that tit shot! Oh, maybe not. No titties. She's gonna live. Is Dewey your real name? No, it's Dwight. Dwight? Dwight Schrute? Treat me like I'm the Antichrist of television journalism. Are they about to get hit by the cars? This is Neil Prescott's car. Sydney's father? No way! No way! Yeah. Yeah, I'm fine. So how was it, girl? Your first time? How you doing? One phone call, so I was just curious. Who'd you call? You know what? That's, I just simply can never get arrested. Why? Because I haven't memorized a phone number in actual years. I would not be able to use my phone call. I don't know anybody's number. Prove to you that I'm not a killer. Probably don't look creepy like that. Billy did not react soon enough. Oh my god. I mean, he died right after he got it in, so it's not the worst time to go, you know? Oh, shit! <laughs> Has nobody found Tatum? 
Oh, I was gonna say climb out of the window. You can't. There's no ledge. You better go. I would get away from the window! <laughs> well, hold on a second. Is it the other friend who said he was gonna go get a beer? No. Because he would have went and got a beer and saw Tatum's body in the garage door. Maybe it is the other friend. Oh, there he is. Oh. Okay, so now I don't know if it's the dad or if it's the other friend. I swear to God, I'm not a big jumper, but I if that adrenaline pump it, I'll hop right over that fence. <gasps> the 30 second delay. Oh, no! I just simply can't figure out who it is. But I'm down to either the dad or the other friend. Kenny, I need the cellular. Girl, Kenny Big Dead. Ooh, 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 ooh. Where is he? On top of the van. Girl's on the outside. What kind of dumbass move was that? He was on top of the van. Just put the windshield wipers in fast mode. <laughs> well, you can file that under the things that I didn't see coming. Oh, no! Oh, no! Girl, what? What made you think that was the right idea? Oh my god, he's coming in the trunk! I have goosebumps! He's gonna try and kill me. He ain't gonna try, girl! He's succeeding! He's succeeding! If he keeps this, we gotta get the fuck out of here! Okay, so it's not him! Please give me that gun! Give me that gun! I don't know who it is! Is it her dad? Well, it's not Green Shirt Guy. It's not Green Shirt Guy because Scream Man was with him. But Yellow Shirt Man has been missing for a moment. Holy shit, Billy's still alive? Excuse me? Excuse me? I was wrong on all accounts. It's called Guess How I'm Gonna Die! That just does sound like a fun game. Oh my god, that's disgusting! Is that motive enough for you? You just had sex! Why are you doing this to her? You're gonna love this. We got a surprise for you, Sydney. Is it her dad? They have her dad! Her mother's anniversary set him off and he went on a murder spree killing everyone. Oh my god! I cannot believe this! I feel like I haven't spoken in a while because I just... I did not guess correctly. Oh, <gasps> nice! Stop talking and shoot him! Works better without the safety on. Oh, rookie mistake, honestly. Nice, nice. Her dad's gone too? Yes! Bitch! You bitch! Where the f are you? I love this. What a little pussy ass bitch! If you're brave enough to kill all these people, like, be brave enough to not be scared of your parents. With an umbrella? Right, now I'm scared of garage doors and umbrellas. Nice! <laughs> Gail! Gail out of nowhere! Woo! So many things happened in such a short amount of time. I'm very sorry that I thought it was him. He has been through it. Wow, good for Dewey for making it that long. Is it over? All right. Let's talk about it! Turn the lights on. Alright, let's talk about it. I'm not gonna switch to the other camera. We're just gonna talk on this one. Oh my god! I got it so wrong on so many different levels. I really thought I was the dad. Oh my god! This movie was so much fun. And it was tag teamed! So that means- so I guess Billy had to kill Tatum because- because why would he kill his girlfriend? But then again, I'm talking about psychopaths, and why am I trying to rationalize their actions and choices? Oh my god! This was so much fun! Okay, so there really isn't a reason as to why it's that white mask. It's just like, because they mentioned that it's sold all through, you know, it's sold all over the state. So it was just the mask that they chose, and they went with. Okay, that makes sense. And here I was, thinking it was going to be Green Shirt Guy, and because you would think it would be him because he's the one that's obsessed with the scary movies. And then you'd think it'd be the dad. They couldn't find the dad. Well, because he was being kidnapped. Oh my god, this was amazing! Oh, 
Plenty of jump scares. This was a great start to Hallow Beans. I had chill bumps. Like, I got so scared in some parts I had chill bumps. I really thought Billy was just gonna be a creepy boyfriend, but it turns out he really was a killer. This was so good. And they referenced a lot of different movies. Halloween was done last year. Again, link to Hallow Beans 2020 down below. And he mentioned Carrie. That's what's coming up this Millennial Movie Monday during Hello Beans. I'm going to give this, I had a lot of fun. I was scared. Good jump scares. I'm a little chicken shit. I'm going to give this movie five out of five stars. Bleeding Green has never steered me wrong. And you know what? This was a great kickoff to Hello Beans. So, I will see you right back here on Monday for Carrie. I have a very highly requested one on Wednesday. Elvira, Mistress of Darkness. That's all I'm going to let you know right now. Like, subscribe, links to social media down below if you want to be my friend outside of the YouTubeverse. And links to Hello Beans 2020 down there as well. Like, subscribe, stick around so you don't miss an episode of Hello Beans. I'll see you right back here on Monday.